Okay, here's our tower. Now we're gonna measure it. Whoa! Oh my god! There's spider web going on it. Okay, I'm just gonna try digging. Oh! No! Ah! <laughs> it's twin time! Hi guys, welcome to Twin Time. Today we're making the biggest stack of Pokemon we can. Huh. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure a lot of you might know if you've seen our other Pokemon videos, we have like a bunch of Pokemon. Look at all this. Mm -hmm. So today, we will be dumping it all out on the floor and on here, we'll be making the tallest stack we can. I'm really excited because it's gonna be really tall. Let's do it. So these are all our normal cards and then in our binders, we have our really good cards. So first we're gonna show you our good cards. So we have very good cards, then the Tag Team Hyper Rare, Articuno, Zapdos, and Moltres, very good. We have Rayquazas right here. Then my Full Art EX is very rare. And then I love collecting a certain Pokemon. First Charizards, and then more Charmanders, Charmeleons. Yeah, she has a lot of Charizards, and I Venusaurs, and like Squirtle. She yeah, loves I collect them. all of these. Yeah. And then we'll all Turtle, Squirtle, and Blastoise. Now here's have his idea. Pikachu collection. We have some pretty good cards. Mm. This one's rare. Yeah, that one's pretty rare. This is a rare. That one. one's good. And yeah, there's all Chris's good cards. Okay, here's my binder. Everyone in the whole family, they all kind of just think I have the best and I kind of do too. So I have three gold cards. Those are like super rare. I'm sure a lot of you guys know how rare the gold cards are. Then I have the Marshadow Machamp Hyper Rare. This one's very good. I have way more Hyper Rares. And then those are two really strong VMAXs. And here I got some more VMAXs. I got Yow, Snorlax, and Tilion. And this is the Eternatus V, it's pretty cool. And then I have my Charizards, I have some very good Charizards. And then I have some more Vs, these are like my super cool ones. Like, they look really cool, like if you look at them up close, they're very cool. I have some more trainers, I have some very good EVGXs. So I got the Umbreon, Glaceon, Espeon, and Deoxys. Those ones are pretty good. I got some more, and I just have a bunch more. And I have breaks. Yeah, we have a lot of Pokemon, and it keeps going for a long time. And then here's my good normal cards, a Gyarados, a Quaza, Z-Guard. And now it's time for the big cards. So, there they are. I have a lot of big cards. We have Sogaleo. Meow V Max, Lucario, Umbreon, and Darkrai, Snorlax, Lucario, Greninja, Copper V. Now yeah, we actually did a video where we hide each other's Pokemon, and then the first to find it gets to keep it. So that was pretty cool. And you know what, Chris? I'm gonna challenge you to that again today. Mm -hmm. Okay, sweet. Okay, we're about to do the challenge where we hide some Pokemon and the first twin to find the other twin's Pokemon keeps them. But this time there's a little twist. We're picking three cards. Okay, so here's my cards. A Hyper Rare, a Gold card, and Copper Aja VMAX. But we have to hide all the three cards together in a clump. So if you find one, you find all. So now let's show Chris's cards. Hyper Rare, Charizard GX. Then we have Mega Venusaur. Okay, let's do it now. Time to head outside. Okay, I'm still trying to decide. Like last time we did it, we did it up there. So I'm wondering this time, should we do it like somewhere else? Or do you think? How about anywhere in the pool? in the pool yard. Yeah. Wow, so that means you have to do it anywhere there. How about right here? This is too hard because there's lots of things, so it has to be in here. Okay, perfect. Okay, you could hide, and I'm going to hide behind here. Got it. Okay, go hide. So Chris right now, he's hiding his Pokemon, and it's a very big area, so it's gonna be pretty hard. But yeah, so this time 
I've been being very risky because I have some very good cards, a gold card, a hyper rare, and a V Max, so it's very risky. If he finds one of these cards, then he's literally gonna get these all, and that's not good. Cause these are like some of my best cards to my collection. Done. Oh, Chris, you're done? Yeah. Okay, sweet. Time to hide mine. So Chris, are you excited to maybe get these? Oh yeah. Yeah, these are some good Pokemon. Okay, hide right there. I've been thinking of a spot. Where should I put it? I'm probably gonna put it. Uh, well, my spot was like up there, but I don't know if that's the best spot. Maybe in here. Can I do it in here? Hmm. Maybe I should put it up there. Let's see. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I could put it in this crack, like down there somewhere. Well, see, he's probably thinking about, like right now, he's probably thinking he should look up here, so I should put it. Hmm. Let's put it right down there. Oh, there's spider webs. Oh no, oh, a spider web going on it. Okay, there, there's a spider web on my card. That was horrible. Let's just try it right under there. Oh no. There, perfect. Uh, hopefully that's good enough. I'm gonna pretend I can get somewhere else. Okay. Okay, I'm done! Okay, perfect. Okay, now how it's gonna work is we're both gonna start at the top of the stairs now I say go, we're both gonna run down and start looking for each other's Pokemon cards. Are you ready, Chris? Yeah. Ready, set, go! Yes, I'm first down the stairs. Like that matter. But I'm over here. Maybe it's in here. Oh, you know what? He probably like buries them. Cause sometimes he likes to bury things. Okay. Hmm, Chris is I'm looking for my Pokemon, this is so scary. Just if he finds my Pokemon, I could be fresh meat. And then he gets them. Huh. Oh, uh, where is he going? Okay, I have to look everywhere. Where are they? Oh, maybe he hid them behind the bushes. Hmm. Okay, I'm just gonna try digging. Oh! No way. I found them! I did. No! Yeah. <laughs> Do you see where mine were? No. I literally was looking there. I was coming down to come in here. Mine was right there, under there. Let's oh get that. Oh my them. gosh, I so could have found that. So now, basically that means I get your Pokemon, right? Yeah. Uh, look at that, look at that. Gosh, that. Now look at my Pokemon. Redo? You wanna redo this? Um, please, I'm not sure about a please, redo, Chris. Please, please, I want these Pokemon. But what if we redo and, like, uh, you really already do? Yes. Fine. Yes! Fine, but I'm gonna make a deal. Since you got to redo, if you find mine, you only get to pick two of mine to keep. Deal. deal. Okay, deal. That it's not losing mine. Okay, here you go. There's <sighs> one card. There's your other. Okay, oh, let's see do. I'll hide first this time. Okay, go. Okay, Chris wanted to tell me something, so he made me stop hiding it. Okay, what is it? Okay, so I was thinking the loser has a choice. They either give up all three Pokemon, or they get to keep one, but they have to jump in the pool. No Ooh. toys in the pool. It's cold, boring pool. Yep. You stay in for over two minutes. Two minutes, okay. And you're not allowed to keep jumping, you only get one jump and that's to get in. Okay, so you just have to sit swimming around in the pool for two minutes, okay? Deal, deal. I'm deal. so getting your cards. No, just watch. Okay, so we both got some swimsuits on, as you could see, just in case one of us has to go in the pool. Okay, Chris, are you ready? Yeah. Ready, go. Oh, there's a big pile here. Okay. 
Okay. Well, see, he might be tricking me with these piles. He's probably just trying to make me dig for nothing. Let's go up here. Okay. I don't think they're up here, but I don't know for sure yet. Hopefully it's down here. I don't want my Pokemon to be gone. Okay. I'm gonna look under these. Maybe he put it in some gross spot no one could touch. What? Cool, I'll keep looking. Oh, look what I just found on the ground. What? Are you kidding? <laughs> you found my Pokemon? Yeah, I was just looking. Okay, I wanna show you one thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. About seven feet away, what's in the plant's <gasps> mind? Wow. <laughs> I get all three of these. Well, actually, what? you get two. Remember the deal? Yeah, because I'm going to go in the pool. Okay, what one do you want? I'm guessing. I'm going to take the gold card because. Hyper and VMAX. This thing's crazy good. Here, hold my gold card for me. <laughs> okay, here yeah. I go in the pool. <laughs> <gasps> oh. Yay! You made it. Uh oh. No! <laughs> oh, you're in. Are you going to jump? I get my one jump. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna make this one a cannonball. Ooh. Nice. Was that good? Yeah. You know what, Zach? What? I thought swimming was a good punishment, but now that I think about it, I think it's already worse. So I think I deserve to swim too. Okay. You go first. Here I go. Woo! Oh, it feels good, but very chilly. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I saw it the camera. Oh, I got it. Uh oh. Okay, Chris, start taking them out. Okay, so we took like a lot of cards out. So we're just gonna start with that because that's already a ton of cards. Like, we didn't take them all. Like, we have more cards in here and a lot more cards in here. So yeah, if we need more cards, then we'll get some more, but let's start making this stack. Okay, so right now we're collecting cards. I just started off the first little pile. I hope it gets like at least this oh, tall. Bigger. Oh, bigger. Yeah, it's gonna be bigger, but still, I hope it still gets really tall. We decided to flip it over because the Pokemon's going to be very heavy and it's already bending down. Okay, here's our pile so far. It's actually, uh, it's pretty good, but it's, we're gonna try to make it like quadruple the size. But, so I think you guys know, Chris was showing you his binder. He collects Venusaurs and yeah. So look, I found this card. Hey Chris, look. <gasps> That's so cool. You don't have that one cool. in your collection. I'm putting it in my binder. He loves yes. Venusaur and I found him a Venusaur. He doesn't have. Yay. Okay, now we're gonna keep working this is gonna on look this good. stack. Look at it, that's so cool. Okay, our stack is pretty big and Chris has a miniature stack he's about to put on top of it. I hope it doesn't fall. Okay, here we go. I hope this doesn't fall because, yeah, we need this stack big. Okay, yes. get it there. Wow, look at that. Oh no. Oh, That's pretty tall. I mean, it's not even that tall. It's just this is my hand compared to it. It's kind of impressive because it's so 
hard to balance. Oh my gosh. I know. This is, this, is, this is like, how many cards do you think this is? This might be like, this is definitely hundreds, maybe even a thousand cards right here. I think one time we counted our cards, we had like 3,000, but since that we've gained more. So, yeah, I think this is like at least a thousand, but that's very tall. Okay, guys, now we're gonna measure. It's over twice the size as my shoe size. So, this is actually getting very big. Soon we're gonna have to be standing up to put them on top, but now for now, I'm just gonna make sure the tower doesn't fall while Chris puts the Pokemon on. So we just put lots more on, and then it started wiggling a lot. Okay, let's see. This is huge, look at my leg compared to it. That's very tall. Now we're gonna have to start standing. Okay, here's our tower, now we're gonna measure it. Okay. Ooh, hopefully it's like, Pretty tall. Whoa! Oh. oh my gosh. Oh no, he had to drop the camera. It started tipping. It's about two, 25 inches it's tall. It's two feet tall. Yeah, exactly Over two feet. Two feet. So like 24 wow. inches. <laughs> okay guys, our brother Michael came so he could help support the tower because it's getting very tall. So it's 26 inches. Oh, that's two foot. Wow. Two foot two, wow, two foot two. Two foot two, so it's two feet and two inches. That's, that's very tall. That's exactly half of my height, exactly. Yeah. I'm four foot four. Okay, David and Michael are here now. This Play is this. like half, this is half of my height about. Now it's gonna be measured. 30 inches, guys, wow. That's crazy. It's getting really weak and we literally ran out of cards. For some reason, these were in there, so. Yeah. So we literally ran out of cards that I no Okay, guys. It's 33 inches tall. This I'm is crazy. It's really very tall. Look at it compared to Chris. And it's, like, it's like a little bit less than a foot shorter than like that's really tall. I know, it's crazy. Okay, so it just fell, as you could see, there's still kind of in clumps, but it was so tall. Wow. Look at all those cards, guys, look at that. So many of that. Plus you still have more in there, and a lot more in there. And imagine getting all those cards and doing it in lines one by one like this. Just imagine how Yeah, we could actually probably fill our whole group with that. No, you could do more. Yeah, you could more. probably do like 50 feet of that. I know. More. That was crazy. It was so big. Wow.